you guys. It's uh, Wednesday, August 15th, I think. <laughs> Not sure about that. Getting a new roof. Uh, make a video here. I didn't make one earlier. I got a bunch of pictures. Maybe I can splice them in here. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, they stripped off the steel that was on there. And uh, I put plywood up there, and now they're putting the... Uh, I don't even use felt paper anymore, some kind of synthetic stuff. Look at that. <laughs> Amazing. I'm putting that on there. I got the ice barrier at the bottom there. I fixed the vent pipe, but the vent pipe was broken. Sorry, hands in the way. That vent pipe was broken off. And up here they're doing rubber because it's not really much of a pitch. Front porch they're doing. Whole house. Yeah, we had steel on there. Wasn't done right. Wasn't flashed right. Uh, didn't have any filler strips or nothing, and it leaked and rotted. Yeah, there was a lot of rotted wood up in this part. Amazingly, the old original part of the house with those old one-inch boards, and uh, they're not they're, they have gaps in them. That's why we had to put plywood up there because there's like one-inch gaps in each board. But yeah, they're not rotted at all. 80 years old, you know. Plus, well, the house is probably built 80 years ago, and those boards are not new. Every piece of lumber of that original part of the house was used. Uh, but yeah, look at this. This is a this is a fail. Now well, this roof was only five years old. But look at this. This is unacceptable. Look at that. That's all silicone caulk. And that's the you know it's just silicone. You can see there's a layer of silicone inside silicone. Let's look at this one here. And it's broken and brittle. And I wonder my roof leaked. But yeah, I don't even know the steel. The steel's all cut crooked because it wasn't put on the roof straight. Uh, when these sheets were standing up, the screw holes are right at an angle, so I can't really use it for a roof. Walls, and look at here, yeah, look at the edges. Woo! <laughs> yeah, walls and uh, ceiling liner and, and, and inside walls. I guess that's what this steel is going to get used for. Yeah, that's not even bronze. My mom and dad ordered bronze, that's gray. Up there is bronze. I might have them do that roof. I don't know yet. Let's see how it goes. I got a bunch of siding to do. The siding's bad. They had to take the siding off the house in order to fix this. I just want to bounce these shaky the cameraman here again. Yeah, all kinds of fancy equipment. Man, I wish we had one of these freaking self-driving, freaking uh, lifting, dumping trailers when I did roofing when I was a kid. I would have saved my back. Anyway. Around here. It's a Chevy. Yuck. You know, if it does, if it runs good, I guess. Yeah, up there, I gotta do all that siding. Uh, I'm gonna have to find some friend of mine to do it. But yeah, all the siding up there had to come off because it wasn't flashed. You know, I flashed it in 1991 when I built it with the original roof. And that's what their flashing was. And it wasn't, it just no wonder it leaked there. I'm gonna go back down. Turn the cell phone here, don't zoom too good. But you can see the shingles we're getting. Certain teed. Landmark, yeah, like a brown color. Oh yeah, there you go, fixing the front porch there. A lot of rotted wood up in that part there. Like I said, this part was good. No rotted wood on here at all, none. Uh, probably a little section there that was patched when the roof was done seven years ago. There used to be a chimney up here where my power vent sits. See, there's my power vent. See, the original. The original house chimney used to be right there. That's the, that's the foundation for it. So it went up that way, and yeah, I did the siding 25 years ago. But yeah, the reason I got to do the siding on the house is see it's the seams came apart, and you can't snap them together anymore. Can you see that? Yeah, it happened a couple places. But yeah, we're gonna try to save the gutters for now. Uh, I got some gutter sealant, and we're gonna wash it out real good and everything. And we'll see. We'll see. Do the best of what we got here. A lot of, oh, here's the, here was the tree. Here was the cluster of trees that was growing out of my rain gutter. Yeah, they had some kind of, guy had, guy had some kind of, uh, uh, screen on top of the gutters to keep the dirt from falling in. All it did was prevent all the, made all the small stuff go in there and created dirt, basically. Yeah, there's the rubber hanging over the edge up there. There's the rubber up there. Putting the rubber on. That part's getting rubber. The rest of it's getting shingles. So, I want to show you what I'm up to. Scott Fest was a success. 
I uh, had a great time. Hope everybody can come next year. It'll be number 15 next year. Amazing how time flies. So there's the old truck. There's the sheds. There's my steel motor home. It needs work. Uh, Yoda needs work. Front brakes are locked up. Uh, town car needs work. Uh, motor mount sunk while it was sitting. <sighs> and I started up, broke the fan shroud. We put a new fan clutch on it. But yeah, the fan shroud's broke. I gotta put motor mounts in it. I gotta do upper control arm bushings, upper ball joints. Gotta get some loving. But the house is a mess, so. Siding on the house, windows on the house. All these windows are bad. Not all of them. The first one up there is bad. All the ones on this side of the house are bad. Yeah, let's get to that. Yeah, they're all. Not all the windows in the house are bad, though. You know, the door, I gotta put some flashing around this trim, but this door, Ivan and I replaced a couple years ago. The deck, I gotta paint the deck. I gotta wash it, paint it. We had so much rain, I, like, we had beautiful weather today when these guys are working. I gotta replace this window. That door I replaced already. These three windows are bad. Bathroom window needs a new screen. That bathroom window needs, it's the window's cracked, so I gotta change that window, but yeah, the other two windows in this front here are fine. It's the freaking expensive windows that were, yeah, look, these are starting to rot apart. But yeah, this isn't really the problem, but this one isn't, this one isn't as bad, yeah, there you go. The whole thing moves, the, they're aluminum clad with wood, and the wood rotted under the aluminum. Upstairs, when I opened the window to put the air conditioning in, the whole thing fell apart. <sighs> Yeah, we just it's like a mon it's, it's it's like a it's like a rainforest here the past couple of years, so look how green it is. I can't even mow. I can't even mow, look at that. I don't know if you can get how green that is. <laughs> I can't mow. <laughs> so alrighty guys, we're in at seven minutes. So just wanted to give you an update what I'm up to and uh, might be some uh, videos this weekend uh, some stuff I'm up to. Hopefully you guys come along with me and enjoy. Alrighty, God bless and take care. Bye bye.